Hi, it's Friday. Uh, it's like 12, almost 1 o'clock in the afternoon, and I literally have like nothing um, that I know I'm doing. <laughs> um, so, I just like, I'm sitting here on the couch, and I'm drinking like probably three-year-old cider, and it's like I'm using one of our coffee cups. Would have been great on camera if I just dropped the cup because it was like because it's one of those stupid ones that's like made out of like the wrong kind of ceramic so it gets like if you nuke it it gets super hot so it's like I had to like I had to wait for the whole cup to cool down because I was the idiot that nuked the cup um, I've known that, I noticed there's some ceramic ones that don't. Like, soup, like, they'll heat up really fast, but then they dissipate heat pretty effectively. They also would tend to cool down your, co your cocoa while you're doing it. Um, so, that's that. Uh, I'm comment on one of the, the, the shower, ice shower video. You look like Jacksepticeye. I had to go look him up. I always have to look him up because I don't subscribe to his channel. Um... I'm just not into watching gaming videos, uh, but I did watch a couple of his vlogs, and I do see the similarities. It's not the first time I've heard it. There's been like this. Uh, it was like the fourth comment, um, and I'm like, that's not the first time. I, you know, maybe one day we'll meet. Maybe I don't know, um, but I guarantee you, I am not an English-speaking football-playing Jack Septic guy. <laughs> not at all. Um, you know, other people ask, what position do I play? Obviously, cornerback. I'm doing actually pretty decent at long snapping. Um, yesterday in the rain with a stupidly wet ball, um, I did get 20 and a half yards. And it's not like the ball... And the ball actually went, like, a decent... Uh, up to the point where the person would catch it. It's not like I chucked it way high in the air and it landed at 20 yards, and I worked more on arc than I did distance, so I threw it pretty fast. The ball was kind of... It, 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 like, it looked like an asteroid that had been roughed up a little bit when it was flying through the air. It was not a perfect spiral. <laughs> but I was not trying to throw it for that. I was just trying to get just sheer distance. Uh, you know, there's a lot into long snapping, and it's understandable why someone who can actually long snap effectively, fast, and accurate why they can have, you know, you can be on, like, a long snapper scholarship. Like, there are, you know, for, like, school, for college, you know, and so, I mean, obviously, anybody wants to have another scholarship to help pay for classes or food or something. <laughs> so, it's like, you can get an ath just an, a pure ath athlete scholarship. Uh, oh, that breaks up. The one guy, now he's all over ESPN and all over the major news. Dusty, gross. My clean, clean freak is kicking in right now. Um, the one guy, uh, what is the channel name? He's a kicker, UCF. And because he's made a YouTube channel, has like 55,000 subscribers, more probably now since, you know, he got on... ESPN for this, but I've known this for a while. Um, I've known this for actually two years, because actually this is the weird weekend. Um, this is actually the celebration, the two-year anniversary of me going to the summit, because the 16th was the Saturday, because Facebook brought that up. Maybe it's a Sunday. Well, anyways, the day that I brought, that I recorded um, at the sidelines, um, and it was, and Kyle Grimes was, you know, a running back, uh, on the Pitbulls, and he was like, yeah, because I wore my Be True shirt, because that's when Aaron left for Istanbul, and I had to do the Summit stuff, and I was mentally exhausted, and I couldn't actually play at the, the, the Renegades game that year, so, so yeah, that was, that was weird, um, 
So I wound up being on the sidelines and wound up recording the game. Uh, link to that weekend? It's kind of maybe an emotional weekend. It's all, you know. So that'll also be at the end of the video here. So we can go relive that one two years ago. But anyways, as I was saying, once I got to the idea of... Uh, that when, and I heard from some of the people at the summit that you can't, that being in the NCAA, there's such rules. I'm like, well, obviously there's rules, like codes of conduct, obviously. And I was like, okay, that makes sense. But I didn't realize that there was like sponsorship rules. Um, and the, you know, you can't make money off your likeness, yada, yada. So... Like, the actual current NCAA athletes that were at the summit couldn't use the free pass to the Nike employee store or company store, whatever. It's, like, right over there. It's like a quarter mile over there. There's a Pokestop in front of it. So, um, and that's what I have, you know, that's what Willie goes into because he's, like, black badge. He has people that work there and you know, get stuff for people. That's where I get my cleats. It's super cheap. So, yeah, that... They couldn't go in there. They couldn't use that ticket thing to go in and get stuff because it would count as a Nike sponsorship. Even if their school is sponsored by Nike and they get all the uniforms and all the stuff from Nike, because then they could lose their eligibility for the NCAA. And I was like, well, that sucks. So I kind of read through some of the other ones. But then at the beginning of this season, I had, I just, I read through them again. And because... And so the sponsorship-ish that I got from Safety for Sports that, you know, I got the helmet and shoulder pads and practice jersey and gloves, all that stuff, basically got outfitted for this entire year. That's, that pretty much makes me ineligible to ever play college, let alone the fact that I already technically was in college at one point, 11 years ago. Um, so my eligibility has run out. It doesn't. Maybe there's a there's a there's a ticking clock once you attend college. Oh, that's terrible. Probably one of the few people on the planet that actually keep drinking something that's terrible just because you don't want to waste it. Anyways, so anyways, this kicker, and he's a good kicker. I've watched some of his videos, but the thing is, he's used his likeness to make money as an yada yada. So it's like stop YouTube. And unmonetize all of his videos or stop being an NCAA athlete, which is a pain in the ass, which is why I can't go into it because I've made so many, you know, I've made money off, you know, a little bit of money off YouTube for three years. That's me being an athlete, at least for two, you know, for one and a half, because I haven't really started making, you know, decent money off this thing until the... Uniform suit up in Feb May. It's so bad I can't talk anymore. January of 2016. Now we're in June of 2017, so that's 12, 17, almost 18 months, a year and a half that my channel's been generating money based on the fact that I play football. Yeah, no, I can't play in the NCAA anymore. Uh, like it is a first year. I am right out. So I, I mean. I understand the issue, and I know I have that problem, you know, and I, I sympathize with the kid because I love making videos. I love, you know, every once in a while seeing a little bit of income from it. I'm not, you know, we're not making a hell of a lot of money here off of it, um, but it certainly helps. Uh, so that's, you know, and he probably, I mean, with 50,000 subscribers, 55,000 subscribers, that's, he's probably making more money than me. But probably not a lot, enough to buy some food, uh, maybe get a better camera, yada yada. Just, you know, maybe even some money to send home, to help his family, or pay for school expenses. But the fact that the NCAA has such terrible rules like that, it's just... I, I, I get it that in other places it's it's just so bad. And I, and I sympathize with him, but... There's not much anything I can do about it. There's not much anything he can do about it. And people sometimes feel like slaves, that you are owned by the NCAA. And it sucks. Where are we at? Oh, my God. All right. I'm so far away from the camera, I can't actually see what the time is. So right there, 10 minutes.